Well, Hello. I wonder if there's enough time to squeeze in like one more thing to do. I was hoping we could still do some more of the Thieves Guild, but that's going to have to be for like next week's uh, worth of stuff. Hmm. Oh, I know. We can we can touch upon on this one. Uh, well, I just need to go ahead and take a look, see here if. Well, like I said, uh, I think I talked about like level requirements at one point, where I can get like the best like stats out of it. But considering where I'm at right now, I figured that highest level items and I have to enchant the items myself will probably be the best thing I can get. So. So really, the rewards I get from this is just going to be a novelty. So, I say we just keep on moving. Alright, so let's take a look at the other quest, Brush with Death. Perhaps they'll give us a good break from all the thieving stuff as of late. It is a pretty interesting side quest for, for us to take a look at here. Although we just have to wait until morning. Can you help me, please? I'm Tavella Lathandis. I apologize that I can't give you the respect a guest in my home would normally receive, but I am at my wit's end. I'm sorry to be so forward, but I desperately need your help. It seems that my husband, Wrythe, has gone missing, and I just don't know what to do. Yes, my husband is THE Wrythe Lathandus. Have you heard of him? Of course not, but tell me more. You haven't? That's strange. Wrythe is known far and wide as one of the best painters in all Cyrodiil. His specialty is setting the great forest to canvas. The paintings look so amazingly real that some say they can see the trees sway in the breeze. Damn. That's just a silly notion, of course. But it just goes to show the attention to detail Wright uses when he paints. Ah, so this world's Bob Ross, it seems. Yes, Wright likes to work in his studio with the door locked so no one can disturb him. He usually comes out to eat dinner and sleep. But two days ago, he didn't come out at all. At first, I wasn't worried. He does that occasionally. But when he didn't come out for a full day, I unlocked the studio with a key he said to use only in emergencies. It turned out he wasn't inside. I'm sure he never left that room. So I have no idea where he's gone. Please help me find Wright. I love him dearly, and I'm so worried. Well, you can always depend on me, ma'am. Oh, thank you so very much. Here's the key to Wright's studio. You may come and go as you please. If you need me, I'll be around the house. Do hurry. I miss my love so much. Yeah, okay. Do be careful. All right. Well, here's a nice little display of everything here. Blank canvases, some paintbrushes, the palette, some finished paintings here. Ooh, something we can enter. Yeah, okay. All right, just watch me do this. I hope she was watching. <laughs> Dang, I like this. Where did you come from? You look real enough. You must be from the outside. Oh, thank goodness someone finally came. While I'm overjoyed to see a friendly face, I'm afraid I have some bad news for you. You're stuck here like I am. Sorry to break it to you like that, but if it wasn't for that annoying thief, we wouldn't be in this predicament. Uh, what, thief? Don't look at me. I was in my studio when a Basma wearing dark clothing accosted me. Before I could call for help, he knocked me unconscious. When I came to, 
I found that the door to my studio was still locked, and that the thief had snatched my paintbrush. That's when I saw it. There was something on the canvas of my painting that I hadn't put there. It looked somewhat like a troll, but it was badly done. Then it hit me. The Bosma must have leapt into the painting, then painted guardians inside to protect himself using the brush of true paint. Brush of true paint? Won the world? I knew the secret of my success would be revealed one day. I can tell you all about the brush if you like. You might as well. Very well. The brush showed up several years ago in the possession of an artist who was serving in the Arnesian War of 396. It seems an errant fireball had exploded next to him, and he lost the use of both arms. He was a stubborn man who didn't want to give up his talent. Being a devout follower of Debella, he prayed to her for something that would allow him to express himself once more. She heard his plea and gifted him with the brush. It said the bristles of the brush are woven from Debella's own hair. That injured man was my father. He passed the brush on to me, and I intend to pass it along to my kin one day. Did you want to know how it works? Probably not. We'd best be getting going. Thank you. You're kind to help someone you've just met. The only thing standing in our way are the painted trolls. The trolls that the thief painted seem to have turned on their creator and killed him. He didn't know the brush had its risks. The creatures are now loose all over the forest, and in the clearing where I was still working. The brush is on the body of the Bosma thief there. I will not be able to help you. I am not a warrior. But take these bottles of turpentine. They might help. Do be careful. Some turpentines, huh? Be cautious, friend. Alright, will do. But yeah, let's take a moment to admire this whole place here, because everything's just all... Feels like I'm in Yoshi's story or something like that. Because <laughs> everything's all painted and childlike. Well, not everything. Because some of them are kind of retextured because of my mod stuff. But anyway. Alright, I just want to go through here so I can see where everything's at. Alright, there's the closest one, right there. Alright, best if I get my proper equipment on. And also to use this here. Alright, come at me. Alright, we actually want to go ahead and collect all of these here, painted troll fast, just because they are a one-time use. There's like, I think like only six of them, which makes sense to the whole thing that we got. How much are they worth in gold? Eh. This amount, apparently. Take what I can get. Apparently that one keeps tripping. Uh. <sighs> Lovely. I just like doing that. So yeah, once we get all that painted troll fat, like, what, what, use, what can we really make use of it, really, because... There's only six of them in existence, and we're not going to be able to get more of them. So we want to make sure that we find and kill all of them. I'm sure there's something. I mean, let's have a look, see here. Fortify, restore. Hmm. Also, let's use another one of these. Eat the process. In fact, let's get our fairy out. Just 
to make sure we're not going to miss any of it. Some of it rolled down. You go ahead and collect the rest. Wherever it may be. Alright, so we're down to our three. Eh. Looks like that's all of that one there, too. Alright, I think that's the remaining two there. Quite nice that they are able to assist you with this very easily. Ah! Wow. So much for a no damage run here, lol. Mm. There you go. And here you are at the edge of the place. Last bit of turpentine and slack. So now that makes a total of six. brush off of him as well as make him disappear <laughs> can you imagine if I still left the paintbrush on there and then converted him I would have been stuck or this quest would have been incomplete or maybe the game would just bug down and crash that works too seems to be expected so things like that There you are. Good work. Now I can paint the portal home. After it's complete, you must go first, or else you'd be stuck in here forever. I'll have to remember to remove the trolls from my painting before I complete this piece. Okay. Follow I mean, me. I took care of them already. All right. Dang, look at that Bob Ross magic there. Tavella. Right. Oh, my love. You're home safe. I was so afraid. If it wasn't for my friend here, you'd be right. Come. You must need food and rest. I will rest. But I must take care of our guest first. I don't know how to thank you. You have a good heart to help me get back home. I'll never forget what you've done for me. Here, please take this apron as a token of our friendship. It's not much, but perhaps it will help you in the future. All I ask in return is to keep the brush's existence secret. If word gets around that I have it, I'm afraid more than a lone cut purse will visit me. Yeah, I know. Like, whatever kind of precious stuff that you have, anyone will want to get their hands on it. I know. Like, YouTubers cannot get the privacy from what I can hear, from what I've, from what I've been told. <laughs> Again, I thank you. By that, I mean like top YouTubers are like saying like, fans are like visiting their homes. It's like, the fuck. That's creepy as shit. I know. So anyway, we got the apron, which this one apparently enhances agility and intelligence. This one has a defense of six. What do I have on me right now? Uh, this, which is more needed at this point in time. So yeah, how does it look on me anyway? Also, I think this is a one piece thing. Cause I think it took off my uh, pants as well. <laughs> Actually, no, it didn't. Never mind. 
whatever. I mean, it's a trade-up. I obviously put shield on this for protection purposes, of course. All right, well, whatever the case, this will pretty much go ahead and conclude this week's segment of videos. And pretty much what I'm going to assign myself to do is, of course, having to go through on another stealing spree to get my fencing amount up to 10,000. And while I'm doing that, uh, what might be considered next on the list for me to level up? I should probably get restoration up to 50, for one thing. In fact, probably a lot of my major skills need to be up at 50. Uh, probably definitely like athletics and all the like. Just want to make sure I just don't want to do too much off camera for like leveling. Hmm. Perhaps if I was like to hit like 25, perhaps it'll be good enough. Like in whatever combination of stuff that I do. Plus, I feel like I should go ahead and give myself a visit to like one of the Oblivion Gates just so I can get some good stuff out of that there too. But I think that's about wrap things up here. So join me next time as I'll see about getting all that fencing amount up. So I'll be able to go ahead and complete the Thieves Guild quest line. Because we pretty much, I think we only got like, I think like two of them left in the lineup. Which is pretty neat. We made a lot of progress. And I'm pretty glad about that. So with it everybody, join me next week for the continuation and the conclusion of the Thieves Guild quest line. I'm Mr. WD, and I'll see you guys next time.